Well, for the first time in three weeks, Western Michigan hockey will be back here at Lawson Arena, getting ready to host number three ranked Denver. The 19 and seven Broncos hoping to get some wins this weekend in their third to last series of conference play. We're a one game at a time team. We don't we don't look right. We don't look left. We don't look ahead and back. We focus on the now. We approach that way every day. Under first year head coach Pat Fershweiler, Western Michigan hockey has almost doubled their wins from 2021. One more dub this weekend gives them 20 on the year and it will be against one of the best. Denver uh, handed it to us pretty good out there in two games and they're building. I think they're the best team that we've played this season. So it's going to be a real challenge. Playing in this conference, you're going to play against uh, the best teams in the nation almost on a weekly basis. So I don't think it's nerve wracking. I think it's more of uh, an exciting opportunity. The Broncos currently sit at third in the NCHC behind the Pioneers in North Dakota, just seven points back with six games to go. The guys say their maturity and level of experience has played a big role in their success this year. Uh, the fact that we have so many older guys, so many guys who have been through uh, the rigors of this uh, conference and season. So, you know, I think it, we, we're a very mature team in that sense, in that if we're up in a game or down in a game, we don't change the way we play because uh, we've all been through it before. The freshmen, sophomores, we have a lot, a lot of sophomores, and they look up to these guys, and they come in every day, work hard, and it's just they set a good standard for us. So it's it's great to see them, and they're excelling too. Last weekend, Western split their series against number eight St. Cloud. They hope to use those games as motivation for Friday and Saturday. A way to claw back and get some points out of the weekend, but uh, we know it wasn't our best weekend, and we can take some learning points out of our weaknesses from the weekend and go from there.